yeah listen i'm sorry for constantly making these videos but i want to make this to necessarily shed light on a lot of this stuff that hit today there's probably going to be more videos that will be dropping discussing this and i guess mine is dropping first or whatever but i'm going to get to the point this is a lot of rumors for a lot of re games and i'm going to leave it all out dust golem yep him has recently claimed that resident evil 9 is getting pushed back to around 2026 or 2027 this is after he said that RE9 was happening in 2025, then said delayed, and wasn't delayed, and now delayed again. The amount of switching up is just terrible in my opinion. Capcom confirmed this year they have three major fiscal titles that are going to be releasing. He said that they wanted to release an RE game along with that to try and boost sales, which Capcom has a tendency to do. Now saying it's not happening, I don't get it. Also, he is denying the RE1 remake rumors for the 30th anniversary. I understand why, because people no one went to you involving those rumors, so I get it. You'd want to play them down since you didn't hear about them first. Now, am I saying that it's in development? No, because it's rumored more than anything else. But I genuinely believe if he got that info first, he'd run with that shit like crazy. So from his word, no RE1 remake. But listen to this. Resident Evil Zero Remake and Code Veronica Remake are in development as of right now. I find that hard to believe, to be completely honest with you. But I guess if you say every single RE game is in development, you're bound to get something right at least. I understand Code Veronica is the most requested remake from the fans and sure it'll be cool to see. But first we were discussing a 5 remake, then a 1 remake, and now we're talking about CV and Zero. This just feels way too flippy floppy. I feel like this dude's word is just not like that anymore. It doesn't feel like it holds weight and it's like, what? I feel like when he's mentioned anything about RE9 rumors and everything else, I ask more questions than anything and it's just my brain telling me that I'm tired of the rumors because every single month when nothing is going on, something happens and someone tweets something out. Dusk has been that guy for a bit, but it just seems so weird this time more than ever. Or maybe this is me finally getting used to him. He has clearly stated that he retired multiple times on Twitter from leaking things, and I just wonder and ask why do you keep coming back, because it feels like for clout purposes. I'm sorry to the people that believe in him because he's not looking good at all. It's hard to just eat up everything he's saying, and I'm seeing a lot of people do that in his Twitter comment section. I'm actually baffled by it. I remember he said that 5 RE games are in development. He has now backtracked to 3. Sure, can the other 2 games be spin-offs or shitty multiplayer games? I guess so. I just don't like how he's moving right now. I don't hate the person or the fact he keeps the community up and alive at times, but this internet persona of him being this quote unquote insider when he's been wrong in the past so many times is just baffling to me. I know what he has gotten wrong in the past. I'm posting the Reddit link in the description, especially about RE Village. Check it out if y'all want. I respect that he is a fan of the series and I can tell from that, but all this info like why even share it with us if you're just going to switch up half the time. Also I remember that there was this discord screenshot where he said that a PlayStation event was happening and RE9 had an 80% chance to be revealed there. Now he's backtracking and saying it's pushed back to a few more years. By the way guys, this has all happened within the past month. I think May and a little bit of April. I swear on everything, if he is wrong about this, we need to stop taking him seriously. I already made a video about an RE0 remake and I will also link that down below. I'm finding him to be way too inconsistent and I'm just tired of it. I truly am. If you guys believe in him and that Zero and Co. Veronica are happening, go right ahead. I'm not going to stop you from that. You just better hope he's right. Am I saying RE9 is going to happen at Summer Games Fest? No, but there's a chance it definitely can. I don't know how to ultimately feel about this info and it just doesn't necessarily add up. Like I said, there's way too many inconsistencies when it comes to Dusk recently. To recap this stuff off, Resident Evil 9 is now delayed into next year or whatever, Resident Evil 0 and Co. Veronica remakes are in development, and the R1 remake rumors are fake. While again, he has said that 9 was supposed to be revealed this summer at an 80% chance, and now since the PlayStation event is the most likely not happening, this is what he is now assuming. I'm sorry if this video is a clusterfuck because that's just how I feel about all of this right now. If y'all enjoyed this video, leave a like and subscribe to the channel. I understand why you guys hate these videos. But more importantly, I need a break.